Another top story we're looking at a troubling sign of the times. A couple of East Bay middle schoolers are hoping to make an impact with a science project. The girls conducted experiments to show how school books could protect against bullets. Here's NBC Bay Area's Jody Hernandez. It's just really devastating to us and you know all the parents can do is just pray that it won't happen to their children even though it could happen any moment. 14 year old Tyler describes the fear many students and their families can't help but struggle with these days. The fear of a school shooting. Right now the school protocol is to hide in the corner, turn off the lights with no defensive protection at all. But we think that textbooks, it's a very common resource and it could be used as body armors. So St. Patrick's School yeah, eighth graders Tyler and Sophia so set out to and prove that their school books the could double as the body shields. So their school science project called High Impact put their textbooks to the test. With the help of a trained firearms instructor, the girls tested how many textbooks it would take to stop a nine millimeter bullet. I was on site at our private shooting range when it took place and I took note of how deep the, uh, how deep the bullets penetrated through each book and we found that it only took two hardcover textbooks. It didn't go through all the way. The girls found that just two one and a half inch books are enough to keep a bullet from penetrating through. Some of the ways that we found were obviously over the head, you know, in case like the shoot, if you guys are hiding in the corner, like school protocol, it could protect the most important part of your body. Emphasize the textbook. The girls are presenting their project at the Contra Costa Science Fair. Their teacher thinks so, like, they have a real the shot at getting fire. high marks. Firearms. It's a, a, an issue that youth should not have to worry about. A absolutely. And uh, unfortunately, it is prevalent in the news. And so it, it, it kind of makes me proud of them that they, they're hearing what's going on and they came up with a, a solution, a possible solution. Win or lose, the girls hope their project makes an impact and helps save lives. One teacher who saw it already said he's sold. He said next um, fire drill situation or protocol, he's going to tell students to grab their textbooks, grab their backpacks, put it in the backpack and use it as a shield. So that really just made our day. Put it over your chest. In like Contra Costa County, Jody Hernandez, no, like NBC Bay Area News.